Introduction to Oracle Cloud Infrastructure, Fast Connect. Hi, I'm trying to uh, link my on-premises data center with Oracle Cloud Infrastructure to run mission-critical applications. But I'm concerned about the unpredictability of internet-based connections. Is there a dedicated connectivity solution that Oracle offers? Sure. Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Fast Connect is a network connectivity alternative with high bandwidth options and better and predictably lower network latency as compared to the public internet. Fast Connect enables you to establish a dedicated and private connection between your on-premises data center and Oracle Cloud Infrastructure resources. I guess that's where it gets the name Fast Connect from. What connection speeds does the service support? You can connect to your closest Fast Connect locations at port speeds in 1 gigabit per second and 10 gigabits per second increments. This enables you to start small and grow seamlessly as your demand for bandwidth between your network and Oracle Cloud infrastructure increases. That's great! How can I get started with establishing a connection? With Fast Connect, you can establish a connection by co-location or via Fast Connect Connectivity Partner. In both cases, the connection goes between the router at the edge of your existing network and Oracle, your DRG. Co-locating with Oracle in a Fast Connect location means this is your physical connection to Oracle within the Fast Connect location. Connecting to Oracle via a Fast Connect connectivity partner means this is your physical connection to the partner and the partner's physical connection to Oracle within the Fast Connect location. For better understanding, let us take a look at the different connectivity models. Physical connectivity, using an Oracle network provider or exchange partner. This connectivity model is suitable if you plan to use or are already using network connectivity services from any Oracle Fast Connect exchange partner. Depending on the partner of choice, you may have to order redundant cloud connectivity services from the Oracle Fast Connect exchange partner. Direct to Oracle, data center co-location. This connectivity model is suitable if you already have presence at an Oracle Fast Connect location or are looking to establish a co-location presence there. You can order two such connections into a data center if you need redundancy. Direct to Oracle, dedicated circuits from a third-party network carrier. This connectivity model is suitable if you have existing relationships with certain network carriers and or if your on-premises or remote data center location is not served by any of Oracle's Fast Connect partners. Once you have established physical connectivity using one of these models, you will also need to ensure you can reach Oracle's cloud services over Fast Connect by exchanging IP routes between your network and the Oracle Fast Connect service. This exchange of routes is accomplished by industry standard border gateway protocol, BGP routing protocol. If you are connected directly to Oracle, co-location or third-party network carrier, your network equipment will be establishing a BGP directly with Oracle's Fast Connect devices. If you are using one of Oracle's Fast Connect network provider or exchange partners, then you may have to establish a BGP session either with this partner's devices or directly with Oracle's Fast Connect devices. What kind of peering does Fast Connect support? Fast Connect supports both public and private peering. Fast Connect private peering enables you to extend your on premises private networks to the Oracle Cloud. You can connect to Oracle Cloud resources like compute IP networks or private subnet resources in VCNs from your on premises private networks without the need to use IPsec VPN or Network Address Translation, NAT. Fast Connect Public Peering enables you to access public services in the Oracle Cloud without traffic traversing the Internet path. Oracle will advertise IP prefixes that belong to all public services in the region where you establish Fast Connect Public Peering. Depending on the connectivity model you choose, you will either need to advertise public prefixes that you own or use a partner who will NAT your prefixes to public IPs that will be advertised to Oracle. The major Fast Connect data center locations are at London, Frankfurt, Ashburn, and Phoenix. 
You can provision direct physical cross-connects, either by being co-located at these locations or by bringing a dedicated private circuit from a network provider that is not already a FastConnect connectivity partner. For a detailed list of FastConnect data center locations, please refer to the link given in the description of this video. Can I connect to all my resources distributed across availability domains when I connect to one FastConnect location? Yes. When you connect to one Oracle Cloud Infrastructure FastConnect location within a region, you can connect to your VCN resources in all availability domains within that region. Click the link given in the description below this video to view all the supported OCI or OCIC services available via FastConnect. Are there any considerations to be kept in mind before setting up FastConnect? Yes, you must have the required details ready before you set up FastConnect. First, you need to identify which data center your resources are deployed in. Based on the identification, choose the connectivity model that suits your data center. The preferred connectivity model is via FastConnect Connectivity Partner. Then, select the peering type. Finally, check if the service to be provisioned supports FastConnect. Regardless of the connectivity model, you have to exchange the router with the Oracle Connectivity Partner. So you require a network equipment that supports Layer 3 routing using BGP. Here is a flowchart that depicts a brief overview of the steps involved in establishing a FastConnect connection by colocation. The first step is planning. The second step is the initial setup of components in the Oracle console. The next thing to be done is to set up the physical connection at the data center. It is now time to activate and create the other components in the Oracle console. Finally, you need to configure your edge router and validate the connection. Your setup is now complete and ready for launching a FastConnect instance. Here is a flowchart that depicts a brief overview of the steps involved in establishing a FastConnect connection via Connectivity Partner. The first step is indeed planning. The second step is to set up the connection with Oracle. The third step is to validate the connectivity. You need to order the connectivity services based on the FastConnect connectivity partner you choose. Your setup is now complete and ready for launching a FastConnect instance via the connectivity partner. Thanks. I now understand how FastConnect works and how the connection is established. You're welcome. With FastConnect's fine-grained control, you can easily create redundant connections required for critical applications and workloads. Please go to the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Portal to learn more. Be sure to sign up for the free trial and get started right away.